you run into all sorts of bands that kind of have it right, you know, and you run into bands that you can sort of tell that they probably won't be here for very long. Yeah, it's weird. You, you can just sort of tell. You, you can, can tell why tell. people are doing what they're doing, and I have no opinion one way or the other what's the right thing to do. I, I just think, you know, there's musicians out there that live and die for it, and that's it. You know, they wake up in the morning and they feel like that's what they've got to do, and, th and they'll be playing music forever, you know. And there's other bands that it's interesting having a different that you journey, can, you know. You can't, you can just tell the mm -hmm. bands that are going to, you know, a band like The Horrors, you just know they're, they're going to be there for a long, long time. You know, it was really nice for me to come back because I had a uh, totally fresh enthusiasm to do a fourth record, you know. Sometimes you can get caught in a bit of a cycle of doing record touring for two years and, um, I don't know, we shook it up a little bit, I don't know. It's good to sort of start again, I think, rather than, it's good to, to forget, you know, to, to not just pick up where you left off, you know. I think sometimes it's good to just completely strip it down and start again. You attack it with a sort of vitality of, of, like an, of a new band, or something. Mm. It's always something that I'd like to do. I think when you're when you're a performer like Alison, you put everything into whatever it is you're doing, and um, you know if you, if if you if you think that you come back unscathed or unchanged, then you're lying to yourself. You know that's the point of it. The point is to go through something, to drag yourself through a hedge, and and the experience have some effect on on your life. I know, I know it all. No, of course not. We don't. I mean, Alison's quite. She has. Quite, she reserves a bit. Secret. You know, she has a part of her that's secret. Which I find really annoying. <laughs> so I'm quite happy to like. I'm just. I let everything out. What I am. How I'm feeling. What I'm doing. How bad things are going. How brilliant things are going. How much fun I had. How many <laughs> drinks I drank. How many drugs I drugged. I just let it all out. I feel like there's still things I don't know about Jamie. Never believe a liar. <laughs> what? <laughs> piece of advice my father gave me. Oh. Never believe a liar. That's good advice. He's a wise man. Mm hmm Yeah. He was one of the three wise men. <laughs> yeah. You're along with your dad. <laughs> and our tour manager. It's one of those, it's just one of those massive feelings. It's kind of an incredible thing to have done this for so long and, it, and yet it just feels like we've been doing it for five minutes, which is beautiful in itself, you know. Mm -hmm.